Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's the girl Ocean JA. What's going on, guys? How are you guys doing? I hope you're having a remarkable day. Guys, seriously, let me start off by saying I appreciate the love, guys, and the support that you guys have been giving me. Wanna subscribe to me? I'ma just love it, guys. Wanna touch my heart? Seriously. Thank you so much. Continue to share with friends and family, guys, as well as hit the notification bell, leave comments below, and give the video a big thumbs up. Today's video, guys, I want to do a Q&A for you guys, and I'm going to get, going to get right into it, okay? First question is, what is my name? My name, you guys know me as Ocean J.A. My name is Natalia Williamson, yeah, and um, follow me at, uh, follow me on IG, right? At Natalia underscore Williamson underscore, and at, on my Facebook, at Natalia Williamson, yeah, cool. Um, where in Jamaica am I from? I'm from Kingston, Jamaica, in a place called Rockford. Rockford! <laughs> wow, Guan. Seriously. So, all my Rockford people out there, big up on yourself. Guys, stay blessed, stay safe. Is it me? Wanna know why me I say so? Stay safe. Yeah? Yeah. Alright, now say nothing. Subscribe to your girl as well if you're from Rockford and you see me and you come across my video. Subscribe because you don't know. We're basically family. Yeah, subscribe to me. You don't know. Um, which school did I attend while living in Jamaica? I attended Winwall Road Primary and Junior High School. Bring back the bus. All right? Yeah. And I also attended Donald Quarry High. DQ. DQ. Yeah, guys. So, you don't know. That's the school I went while living in Jamaica. Um, Fort number four is... What was my favorite subject? Me, I look down so long because I'm getting confused with the questions, guys. You know, so I have to keep track. What, which, what was my favorite? What was my favorite subject while attending um, school, right? Yeah, four. Mm -hmm. My favorite subject, guys, forgive me. My favorite subject was biology, mathematics, and uh, I would say guidance and counseling. Yeah, many love that, right? Next question is, what do I love about Jamaica? What do I love? What do I love about my beautiful island of Jamaica? Oh, God. I want me to start now, lad. All right, let me see. I love the beaches. I <laughs> love the beach, guys. I miss being able to just get up and just jump in the salt water to wash off the crosses. You see me? Wash off any crosses. <laughs> Most of you guys probably understand me. I know you guys understand what I'm saying because most of you guys are Jamaican. Yeah, my miss going down at the beach. Go wash off the crosses. Yeah. Right, guys? Beautiful, beautiful beaches. I love the climate. I don't know. You can sit on outside all day, every day. Yeah? I love the food, the people, the music, the culture. 100% everything about Jamaica. I love it. I love, love Jamaica. That's it. And I could I could go on and on, but I won't. <laughs> because I'm not done for now. I'm not going to talk about my country, right, guys? So next question. What is my favorite drink? My favorite drink is water. Water. I don't drink coffee. I don't drink tea. I would try stuff, you know. Don't get me wrong. But at the same time, it's not like I don't have a favorite drink. And I say, oh, God, I have to have it every day. No. I, that's not it. And if, I, if you want to talk about alcoholic beverage... I'll probably drink a Magnum. Right, guys? Yeah. Um, Favorite food? Stew peas and rice, guys. Stew peas and rice. My love, 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 love. My stew peas and rice. As much as we make it over here, I don't think it's like authentic Jamaican stew peas and rice. But, no. It can go on. <laughs> it can go on, right? Yeah. Um, What is my favorite song? So, I was born in the 80s. So, I'm, and I think that I'm still stuck there. So, without a doubt, guys, my favorite song is anything from the 80s. Yeah, give me give me the slow jam. All these what goodies, that is me all day, every day. I love reggae music too, you know. You see me, if you want to have a different vibe, you have to tune into some reggae. But for me, if I was going to just pull up something on my phone, I would pull up like some, all these what goodies. You know me, I said some slow jam, straight up. Favorite color, my favorite color is gold. I love anything shiny, anything blinging, gold. Okay? <laughs> I love gold, guys. Yeah. Um, do you have kids? Yes, guys, I have 
three kids you guys i talk about them all the time yes i have three amazing kids yeah <laughs> we have three kids right i love them what are their names <laughs> all right so azana is seven years old right azana is seven years old akila is four years old and my bunanunus right he's one his name is azan and i call him papa <laughs> i do i call him papa right guys yes i love them dearly they're my world i'm alive let me just throw this little thing in if you're a parent out there big up yourself you know you don't have a handbook you don't have a you don't have a book to tell you how to become a parent right so you have to just feel it from here and just use air and just do the best way you can do for them. And just remember that once you have kids, guys, it should no longer be about you. Seriously speaking, and that's just my opinion. Because you guys may say otherwise. That's just my opinion. You know me, I say I have kids and I feel like my world revolve around them. All right, see, you see now, me go go on and on about my kids. They make me stop. <laughs> so, so that's their name. All right, done. Um... What's my favorite book to read? My favorite book to read, guys, is my Bible. My Bible. Yeah, guys, my Bible. I have to check my mouth. Look, my mouth nice. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. Jesus, I'm just going to add about myself. <laughs> Seriously, forgive me. My Bible, guys. My Bible is a favorite thing to read. My, my most favorite book to read. Because, guys, remember now, your Bible is life's guideline. Seriously, if you want to know what to do, how to do it, when to do it, where to do it, check your Bible. Everything to overcome, it, it motivates you, it inspires you, it encourages you, it pushes you, and it helps you to overcome all of your struggles Then we are got through. Check it out sometime. <laughs> it helps your Bible, guys. What's my favorite perfume? My, guys, my favorite cologne is... Um, Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret, guys. When I was like growing up, I had this, I got this cologne. It was Victoria's Secret, guys. Trust me. It's unlike anything that I've ever smelled. Me not think so no Chanel, no Gucci, no, no Berry Berry, no Jodor Dior. And I love that too, you know, Jodor Dior. I love that one too. But trust me, nothing comes near to this one. To me, that's just my opinion. I don't know what it's called, guys. Because I got it when I was a little bit younger. But the scent still, still, it still stands out in my mind. And I haven't seen any, I haven't smelled anything that smells like it ever since. So that cologne that, that is gone <laughs> would have been my fav, my most favorite cologne. That's it. Yeah. Um, What's my favorite holiday? My favorite holiday is Christmas. Christmas, I'm a favorite holiday. All right. Yes, guys. My love Christmas time for family and friends. Okay. Cool. Where is my husband from? My husband is from Pakistan. He's Pakistani. He's from the country of Pakistan. And he's from, where is he from? From Lahore. He's from Lahore, Pakistan. Right? Yeah. Do you have siblings? Yes, guys. I have siblings. I have six siblings i love them i have five sisters and one brother they want my world big up on yourself stay blessed and just continue to just stay happy and just go on with it you see me love them. all right because I, I don't want to start crying when they come out to my family you see me yeah all right um did you like okay so this one um your favorite restaurant what is my favorite restaurant so living here in Canada, I would say my favorite restaurant is Red Lobster. But now we're gonna more night because I'm not sponsored my video yet. <laughs> yeah, right. So Red Lobster, that's it. Um, did you like going to school? Did you like going to school? Of course, <laughs> I love school, guys. I love school because growing like when I was in um when I when I attended Winard Road, I used to be like a guidance counselor. You know, if you remember guidance counselor, student counselor, all these things. Yeah, guys, I used to be a guidance counselor while attending Winwood Road High School. While attending Winwood Road High School. Okay, I loved it. And in Dangakori, I 
when we are primary and junior i okay in case i just messed up i think i said whatever I, whatever when we are primary and junior high school yes i used to be a guidance counselor okay so if you know you had your problems you could come to your girl and she could solve it okay all right and in Donald quarry high school i used to play football i was the captain for my football team yeah yeah no. so of course i love going to school school is amazing guys stay in school all right i'll do i'll be an adult mom channel right guys because this is the adult channel but yeah stay in school <laughs> i'm like we can't stay in school guys okay stay in school all right cool um next one what's my favorite movie my favorite movie is i don't have a specific movie but my love arrow movie anything arrow like chainsaw massacre you know me i say like anything just the ring you know them way there anything spooky creepy crawly you know, oh, got you on them, something them like it, you see me? Coming upon, run no girl, you fool, you see me? Yeah. So it just leaves me on the edge. I'm like, oh my God, you know, creepy. Don't be there on the side, I'm in a new So, yeah, guys, I love scary movie. All right. And this is the last question, guys. Last question. Um, Why should you guys subscribe to your girl? Okay. Why should you subscribe to me? No. For friends and family, you, you must subscribe to me because that's what we do. We support each other. Guys, we support each other as friends and family. You see me? If I have a friend or if I knew someone, I don't even have to be friends with you, but I, I probably saw you around my community or I saw you at school or whatever, and I know that you're, you know, doing, you're venturing in anything. Guys, I will be your biggest support. 100%. You see, words if you know you personally, trust me. I mean, even I feel, like, for example, if you're doing a YouTube, I don't even have to watch your videos. If I see your face, I'm going to say, I know you. What? Boom. Subscribe. Done. That's how I am. I know that everybody's not like that. So, subscribe to me because you can relate to me. Because I have a message that I want to give and it, it is being received by you guys. Subscribe to me because of those reasons then. You know what I'm saying? If you're a mom, if you have a weight loss journey like myself, if you're into my affirmations, or if I'm just, as I said before, my message is being, you know, received, subscribe to your girl just for those reasons alone. And I think the biggest reason for you guys to support me is because I'm a Jamaican, you're a Jamaican, support each other. <laughs> is that too corny or what like seriously if you're a jamaican and you come across my video because remember guys it takes nothing for you to just hit the, the button the little red thing that says subscribe it takes nothing in the energy it takes a little time because you know time yeah and in the money it's free so you don't know show the love you see me Show the love. And if you're not a Jamaican and you come across my video, as I said before, if you're if you're on a weight loss journey like I am, or my affirmations, or you just love my vibes, you know what I mean? Or you just love my style. Anything at all that makes you gravitate to me, that you can relate to me, subscribe just because of that reason. I don't know. I don't know if that's convincing enough. I don't I don't think I should have to try to convince you guys any more than that. Than just say, you know what, we're all humans. We're all trying. You know, you are trying, me I try. This is how I'm trying to make a living eventually, right? While share my message and stuff like that. So, you can subscribe to your girl. This is me. I think that'll be it for today, guys. It was my pleasure sharing some things about myself with you guys. I hope you had fun. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you, you, you find out a little more about me, right? And I'll see you in my next video, guys. Stay blessed in abundance. Stay happy and stay strong. Peace, guys. I'm out.